Last video we had Ron from Alone Off Grid up to visit, showed him the sights of Southeast Alaska. In this video, we're going to Sweetheart Creek where we catch over 100 salmon in less than two hours. But it all starts at 3 o'clock in the morning. I got a net. I guess I need it. All right, so it's 3:50. Our departure time was at 3:45. I'm I was running a little behind. I had to poop. <laughs> it's good to get that out of the way. We got Mr. Funk out there in the in the boat. Mr. Olmstead right here. Man, it's hard to see anything right now. We're gonna uh, start our adventure here in a little bit and in a couple hours we'll be at Sweetheart Creek. That's a boat. That's definitely a boat. Yeah. yeah. that hey oh you're supposed to say i love you i love you i already did you missed <laughs> that part you. this is love what's you, called sweetheart. you guys may luck be with you <laughs> we'll see you So today we're going to be fishing for sockeye. We're bringing cast nets. That's how we're going to be uh, catching the fish. And uh, I just wanted to say thank you to uh, Justin Case Holsters. He outfitted me with this new chest rig, and man, I love it. Uh, so the, the cool thing about uh, Sweetheart Creek is you're literally fishing amongst the bears. We're all going after the same thing. We're going for sockeye, and uh, the best luck to both us and the bears. 
So little did we know while we were flying the drone around, we were actually going to catch a guy throwing a rock at a bear and then uh, hitting it with some bear spray to scare it off. Anchor in the boat. Anchor in the boat. You ready to catch some fish? Yes. Yeah, me too. All right, Brian, that's probably good. Let's see if it'll stick. Oh, she's gonna stick. She's gonna... Pretty good stick? Yeah. This anchorage is my most nervous. You want me to back the boat up while you're doing that? Oh, that's stuck. Would you trust me? I'm, I've had a bad. <laughs> I've got a nightmare of this spot. Oh, I know. Well, the no CMs are already out, so that's good. Luckily, we brought the um, bugs with it this time. Uh, you like my knot here? <laughs> yeah, I do. You know, they say if you can't tie a knot, tie a lot. Right? Yeah. <laughs> um. <laughs> I like your new shoes. This video is sponsored by hi -C. They uh, gave us all a new pair of waders and uh, we just really appreciate their support. Love it. Can Thank you. The... <laughs> Can I get the hi -C logo in there? Yeah, for sure. He's in. And we're in. doing how's yeah. that motor is he getting heavy yet <laughs> <laughs> no it's flat as a feather they call it a portable so we came in on a low tide a negative two so the uh, stream's not big enough or high enough for us to get the boat in so me and captain steve are carrying the boat and captain funk over there he's carrying the uh the motor when we reach the other side funk's coming up a little more upstream than we did but we just got to get this lowered into the Beautiful. water and then let it float and we'll drag it along she's floating. beautiful it off last time anyway yeah just tie it off on this side yeah let's just bring it up here and go explore and kind of see what we what do you we think can about find that? out what do you think about the water height that's amazing look at that water coming down it's rushing rushing not as high well it's low tide but it's rushing yeah jumping up yeah 
I mean, I don't know, oh, that's, right that's the spot. So we almost need to go on the other side. Yeah. Unless you want to try right here, there's a school right here. Yeah, I remember the last time we did this, it's just moving so quick. Cross the river. Yeah. yeah. We, yeah, he'll have enough line. Yeah. down in there so you can see them all in there we're gonna throw our net down there and see what we come up with Good job, Brian! That's a good sign, some fish have been caught. I'm gonna go around this ledge here and look at Steve's fish he just caught. Hey buddy! How's it going? We wanna check out your fish! Oh that was a good haul! Yeah, it was. <laughs> oh man, look at that. Look at all those. Woohoo! Yeah. Oh, those are nice. Those are big. Yeah, that was a good haul. Here. Oh yeah. Nice. Well done, brother. See him. Yeah, right there. Yeah, I need to walk in there because look at they're right there. You see him in there? Okay, too. Oh yeah. Oh beautiful. I want to thank I see these are awesome waiters thanks so much the mother load oh my They've just come up with the, That's what I was the tide coming up. These are big. It's, it's 
picked up quite a bit. Yeah. Oh man. Every cast you're making, you're getting yeah. five to ten. Like you just get it spread out, there's there's come, they're coming in. Wow. You just got that stringer. Good job, Steve. Tell it's a pink salmon. Also a humpy. The hump here, the spots on its side, white belly.
yeah. Yeah, I love you start seeing that spark. Yeah. Nice job, Steve. Look at the haul of fish you're bringing in. Yeah, a little bit, but yeah, this is fun. Sure. Yeah. Well, Jan will be super happy about the pinks, too. Yeah, good. I got a good size pink in there. Wherever he is. Yeah, baby. It was 67, but... surface on them. No, just right there. Yeah, but you, it's best to get someone on the other side pushing them over. Oh my god. This is so nice. Dude, we got the limit out and we're floating down. Yeah. It is nice. No 
Good. Uh. Whoa. Uh. Should probably. Well, we had a successful fishing trip. Now we got to do some fish cleaning. We're just going to gut them, throw them on ice, and then uh, head back to the island. It's a great day. Oh, it was a great day. We we limited out. We got 75 sockeye and we didn't count how many pinks we got. Probably close to 25. Yeah. We uh we kept catching a dog salmon. We kept throwing it back. But it kept coming, it kept getting in the net though. <laughs> Then I have some little gloves that somebody gave me to help you prevent cutting your hand and just helps gripping the fish. I should I should try them out because these things are slimy. Oh man, they are. I know. I'm trying to wrestle them on the rocks when they're flopping around. <laughs> <laughs> Well, we got all the fish cleaned up. Both of the Steves are washing down the deck. I'm just getting out of their way. We'll pop the coolers here in a second and show you it. We're allowed 25 uh, sockeye a piece, so we limited out on that. And then we caught probably 20 pinks. So we're going to count the pinks just to make sure um, we, got, we got what we needed to get. So we're... Uh, what are we calling this? This is the damage we dealt? Yeah. What is 75 sockeye plus however many pinks you got? He cut the heads off because he's taking his to town and it's going to be lighter. Yeah, the heads are going to be crab bait and halibut bait. Perfect. So, yeah. So, three coolers of sockeye, one cooler of pinks. Great day. Great, Great day. day. Another big thanks to uh, High C for uh, sponsoring the video and sending me and the Steve Olmstead, Steve Funk, some uh, new hip waders. They came in handy. We all stayed dry, no leaks, and we were we were uh, scooting around on our hands and knees, getting up over the rocks and stuff. So uh, uh, we're, we're, we were all pretty impressed. We thought for sure we were going to snag them a couple times, but never did. So, anyways, thanks again to High C. Offloading of the uh... <laughs> oh, we didn't oh, take yeah. a picture of the coolers together. Oh. Is it on? Brian? Yeah, I was filming that. Yeah, well, maybe not a hundred percent. I'm going to let you go get your trailer. Alright. There you go. Right. Tola did it. <laughs> yes. oh. Well, for the last day and a half, we have been filleting and canning these uh, these sockeyes that we've caught. So we've got, this year we're going to have eight cases of, uh, of canned sockeye. We didn't, we smoked a little, but uh, the majority of it we canned. And so, um, anyways, eight cases, that's going to last us a year. So we'll uh, look forward to doing this again next year. And always remember, live free.